in this video I will show you how to re-add a workload once you have removed the workload from the migrate client. Once you try to re-add the workload you may see this error failed unable to add a workload because the workload with the host name or IP address you specified is already listed in the web interface. If you do come across this error what you need to do is you need to go to the web interface where you will see the workload you have already tried to add is there. You need to click here and click remove workload. Now once you click remove workload you need to untick this box preserve source. This will come up with a warning about removing the workload without preserving the source information will undiscover the workload. This means the license that is linked to the workload will be lost and cannot be reclaimed. This is okay to proceed once you have not done a successful replication of the workload. If a successful replication has been done I would suggest maybe to contact support for further assistance. If uh, you have been advised by support to remove the workload, I would proceed with this if the workload is in a failed state where a full replication has never been done. So from here we can see the workload is now removed. So if we go back to the tick client and we click close and click discover, we can now see that the job has started successfully. Thank you.